Starting your education at a community college is a smart and affordable way to get your career on the fast track. Almost as fast as these rapid prototype machines can print up three-dimensional designs. Check it out. We're going to do some silicone casting. Let's talk a little bit about different kinds of silicone. This is the uh, rapid prototype modeling class. When people used to design a product, they used to have to like make it by hand and carve it out or like build it separately. But now this is the way that we can do it in a computer and do the whole design digitally, three-dimensionally. OK, open the door. And then print it out layer by layer, which would give you a solid model in the end. going straight from your idea to the creation without having to take too much time in between. The silicone, you're going to get air into it. What the vacuum's going to do is it's going to pull the air out of it so when you cast it against your model, you won't have any air bubbles in it. The reason I'm in the community college is it is more about um, the hands-on, using the product, learning how to use them, and the trial and error of maybe getting them wrong to figure out how to use it properly. So what we're going to do now is we're going to turn the vacuum on at first, it's a little intimidating to use such expensive equipment because you don't want to be the guy who drops a piece in there and uh, there goes a $250,000 machine because your part drooped. Now, see the bubbles already coming to the top? My goal is to transfer to the University of California, Irvine for aerospace engineering. You get to build things and your creations have a chance of changing the future. Companies are looking for this right now because it is more or less the wave of the future. And so me knowing how to do it puts me in a better spot than a lot of people. If you're interested in rapid prototyping, be sure to look into your local community college for design and manufacturing programs that utilize the latest technology. For more information on anything you've seen today, explore our website at atetv.org. Thanks for watching.